G'day guys, Cam Wild Wild Touring. It's a bit windy down here at the beach, but um, there's an easterly blowing, so the water's nice and flat. That's kind of what I find I'm looking for over here on the west coast. Nice easterly means beautiful flat conditions. So anyway, I've come out for a bit of a fish. Um, just gonna flick a lure around and see what happens. Just checking the forecast, it's blowing about 15 knots, which is about 25k an hour. And uh, I really, I reckon this is the perfect setup now. The 30 second awning is, is really good bang for buck. I've talked about that before. But um, these tie gear straps and those rhino rack long auger style screw in pegs, it's just a wicked system. I think these tie gear um, tie downs, I'm not even running them the right way. I think he designed to run them the other way with this bag towards the bottom. But um, I've been running them this way and I just find it really convenient. Anyway, wasn't much uh, much luck on the fishing front there, but that's okay, because I actually brought some fish down to cook up some lunch today anyway. So I went out fishing with a mate the other day and I caught my first ever harlequin fish, which is a pretty cool looking fish. I managed to get a little bit of footage while I was out there. So while I'm cooking this, I'll roll some of that footage for you. Good job. Oh, yeah. Yeah, good fella. Oh, yeah. Dewey. Oh, nice. It's a Dewey. Beautiful. Little fella. That's what we want. Nice for the start. Cool. You got a decent size one, there, right? Might have a good one. You got a net or a um. Come on. Oh, that's good, right? Is that a bit? Yeah. Look at this guy. That's it, mate. Don't, don't put too much drag on it. Just let it, let it fight himself out. It might be a kingy or something. You reckon? Yeah. He's got some power. There you go. Let him out. Ah. Oh, is that my rod on as well? No, it's all right. Jeez. Woo Woo. Testing your rod. What are you there, calling? Man. What do you reckon? Oh, I don't know. Has it got head shakes? Or is it just. I lost it. Oh, really? Yeah, gone. No. Oh, are you kidding me? He must have pulled it. No, pulled. He, yeah, he was, uh, he was right there. Holy shit. Quagga. Yeah, it's pretty good. What is it? Sergeant Baker. Oh, okay. But these are really good Jewy bait. Okay. Jewies love them. Cool. They fill it up the side of them. Oh, uh, green. 
That is the grass. Or cold or something. Oh, oh mate. It's beautiful. Oh, <laughs> mate. That's a... Um, oh, all on the board. Oh, that's awesome. a beauty. Wicked. Right? Oh, mate, that's that's beautiful. Sweet. Oh, how cool is that? Happy days. Um, nice. Yeah. So although we didn't actually catch a hell of a lot that day, um, I put a new species on my list, so I was stoked with that. And um, it was a really good day. Conditions were wicked. I did get um, seasick out there though. I don't normally get seasick. And it was really calm conditions. But I just, yeah, wasn't feeling too flat. So if you've got any sort of remedies for um, getting seasick, what works for you, I'd love to hear them. Anyway, this fish looks beautiful. I put too much on. It's supposed to be a five-star eating fish. That is beautiful. I can't believe how busy it is out here today. This beach, normally don't see anyone here midweek, but I guess it is summer. The weather's beautiful, the wind's going the right way. <clears throat> and it's actually February 1st today, so kids have gone back to school. And I reckon there might be a few parents that decided, like me, that decided to come out and soak it up. Anyway, I'll leave you there. Wasn't a hell of a lot of footage of that, but I just wanted to share it with you because I was pretty stoked to catch that harlequin. And um, it, it looked a hell of a lot like the coral trout on the back of my fishing shirt, which I thought was pretty cool. Anyway, cheers guys, I'll see you in the next one. Oh, actually the next one's gonna be cool. From next week, there's gonna be a bit of a mini series, me and a few of the boys going way down south around Bremer Bay sort of area. Um, probably a couple of hundred k's of beach driving, full driving, bush, um, some interesting cook-ups, should be good. So. Check that out if you're into it, starting from next week. Cheers, guys.